SPD is coming along now. Still working on this, but it's looking good. Yeah. And then I'm also working on Samurai. Also not done. In Mystic Force, I did add another Solaris Knight. He's in there. I put the carpet version there. There's another bike version over here. Yeah, looking good. Power Morphicon is next month already. So who's going to be at this Power Morphicon? Last week they announced Campbell Cooley. Hey there. It's the Dynamorph Charger voice. <laughs> T-Rex Charger, engage! <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> and many other voices. And you guys remember our friend Neil Kaplan? He's, he's gonna be a lot less frightening if he's in the box. Yeah, but he's gonna be a lot less valuable if he's out of the box. Take me out of the box. No. Think of the joy of destruction. I know everyone's excited to see the Rangers, but don't neglect the bad guys and the voice actors. They're a lot of fun too. It's an evil villain buying food. <laughs> Man, Rancic gave me the finger. As I was saying, Power Morphicon is already next month. It's coming up real fast now. So something I've been noticing a lot on our channel and our comments and just online in general is a lot of fans, even their most favorite season, just not remembering things, not remembering characters, episodes, storylines, just all sorts of things. So I don't know if these are the same people that are also going to Morphicon, but I would strongly recommend, probably too late to marathon seasons, but at least go back and maybe refresh some episodes, a couple different seasons here and there, just so you have a general idea. Might help you think of some good questions you want to ask at panels or individual actors. Some previous shows have had costumes and props on display and for sale. And at least to me, it seems like it would be a lot more exciting to see these things in person if you actually remember what they're from. On Facebook, I just asked who could name this monster. Most people couldn't. Wolfbane is from like one of the most iconic episodes of Zeo. That's the Gold Rangers debut. That's like one of my all-time favorite episodes. I don't know about you guys, but that episode is awesome. There are just like so many different ways that you're going to get more out of the con when you remember things. Imagine you're one of the many people that missed out on Mystic Force. You go to this Morphicon, you kind of ignore those guys because you don't really know who they are. You go home, somehow you end up watching Mystic Force, maybe on YouTube or on DVD, and you're like, wow, this is a really awesome season. Well, at the Morphicon that you had just gone to, Red Ranger, Green Ranger, Blue Ranger, Pink Ranger, Solaris Knight, Genji, Korag, Phineas, Lily, Toby. That would have been a really incredible Mystic Force reunion that now you've kind of missed out on that you might have really been interested had you seen the season before going to Morphicon. So you know what I'm saying? And you never know, another Morphicon is never promised. It could be your one and only or your last Morphicon. You might never get this, you know, the same group of actors. A lot of these guys are coming from New Zealand, some first time in the US. So my advice would definitely be look at the guest list, see who all is going. A lot of Jungle Fury actors are gonna be there this year. And, you know, consider getting caught up or checking out some seasons that you might not have seen yet. And then you'll know who these actors are. You'll get more out of the panels. Maybe you'll really wanna meet some of the people that are gonna be at this con and maybe not at future cons or Maybe you won't be at the future cons. Maybe there won't be future cons. You just don't know. So, maybe most importantly, we need to talk about toys. There are so many toys at Power Morphicon. If you just want to go and walk around, see what they got, maybe buy something if you notice something that interests you, great. You know, if you're a collector and there are specific things that, that you know you're looking for, maybe have a list. Because there's a ton of stuff to see and you don't want to go and not be prepared. And as I was making this video, this actually got interrupted by a train show that snuck up on me. And then I went to the train show while I'm trying to make this video for you guys to let you know about not being unprepared for Morphicon. So I'm actually at a train show right now. 
kind of snuck off on me and I didn't actually make a list of what I'm looking for. So I'm just kind of, and I was not prepared. For, <laughs> I was not prepared for the train show. Like somewhere I had a list of things I'm looking for. I couldn't find it. I ended up buying something that I already had for the scenery I'm working on. I did the exact opposite of what I'm here to tell you guys. Do as I say, not as I do. That, that's what, that's, yeah, that's what I'm saying here. And that list I have for the big trains that I collect, I also noted by each thing that I'm looking for what the average selling price on eBay is. So as I go to the different vendors, I can kind of see, you know, some of them they'll give you a really good deal. Others are kind of high. You know, different vendors have different prices. So like at, you know, MorphoCon or any other con, you might find a book that has like really reasonable prices and others that are asking like way higher than you might find on eBay. So yeah, it's a good idea to kind of know what things you're going for. Research is always a good thing to do. Like no matter what, it's good to kind of know what you're looking at, whether I take my own advice or not. Know what you're looking at, do a little bit of research, do some homework. <laughs> Homework's such a fun word in the summer, right? And also keep in mind, Mighty Morphin is now 31 years ago. Not everybody that was working on the show 31 years ago was a kid at the time. So, you know, there might only be so many more cons that certain actors or cast and crew are, are going to, so, you know, that, that also gets into don't keep putting MorphCon off if it's something that you really want to go to. You know, I know everyone can't go so easily, but it's been going since 2007, so everybody knows that it happens every other year. It gives you a chance to save up, make it possible. At least if you're local, definitely consider going sooner than later, because like I said, the show's been on for a long time, so, you know, <laughs> not the most fun thing to think about, but there are already a number of actors that aren't going to be at future cons, so, you know. All right, anyway, all right, I'm going to end here and get back to some of the other stuff we're working on. Thank you guys for watching. Check out some of the videos you've missed on both channels. Thank you guys for watching. Good night. Rangers, call to action. It's Morphin time. Sabertooth Tiger. Mastodon. Tyrannosaurus. Pink Ranger Power. And it's Morphin time. Rangers of Avatar. We need more power. Zero Ranger 2. Yellow. No Ranger Power. Time for Time Quantum Power. Wild Access. Wild Access. Well, that's this. RPM, get in gear. Samurizer, go go samurai. Oh! Beetle Hunter, Beetle Blast. On my name's Marshall Hilton. I was Les Fortunes on Beetleborgs Metallics season two. I want to thank you all for coming to Power Morphicon 2012. It was awesome. And this is Les Fortunes. Don't piss me off. This is Nukas, Overlord of the Second Dimension, thanking you for attending Power Morphicon 2012. Cartoonist! You left me to die, floating around in space. Well, I didn't die. I'm here, alive, and kicking, and I'm here to stay. Goldar will never die. Thank you all for coming, and I'll see you in detention. <clears throat> You can't believe I was the voice of Gluto. <laughs> I hope you had fun this weekend and thanks for coming. This is Rancic, and this Morphicon is over. Something about the stars of Orion. Man the Defender went down with honor. Forget me nots. Ah, fans. Lord Zed here. Thanks for coming to Power Morphicon. Hi, everybody. Thanks for coming to the Power Morphicon 2012. Come to the next one! See you next time! <laughs> Thank you, and God bless.